With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, so question is saying this, which of the following is a bactericidal antibiotic, right? So option A is a flexosin, option B is tetracycline, option C is chloramphenol and option D is erythromycin, right? So actually it is a memory based question but you have to remember it right so now you can see here if i talk about this some basic concept over here what do you mean antibiotic right so, and what do you mean by bacterial cidal antibody right? so you can see here right so now you can if i talk about antibiotic right so if i talk about antibiotic right so let's see here this is antibiotic right so antibiotic are those which is which prevent from us bacterial infection right so i can say this which prevent from bacterial infection right right so i can say this this is bacterial infection bacterial infection right so that means they cannot work on virus right so they can only work on bacteria right so they can only work on bacteria right so these antibiotics are of two types right so these antibiotics are of two types right so i can say this these are of two types one type is you can see here one type is bactericidal right so one type is bactericidal right and another type is the second type is bacteriostatic right so that is bacteriostatic right so these are the two types right so in bactericidal right so in bactericidal you can see here in bactericidal these antibiotics kills the my microbe right so i can say this this these bactericidal antibiotics are they kill the microbe right so i can say they kill microbes kill microbes right and while in the case of bacteriostatic while in the case of bacteriostatic they inhibit the growth of inhibit the growth of microbes growth of microbes microbes right so these are the basic difference between bactericidal and bacteriostatic right so now if I talk about the examples of bactericidal, right? So if I talk about the example of bactericidal, right? So let's say here, write down, if we write down the example of bactericidal, right? So you can see here, bactericidal, right? So this is bactericidal, right? So there are examples, right? So for example, penicillin, penicillin, right? So penicillin is one of the example and another example you can write like this that is oflaxosin right so you can li like this that is oflaxosin right so this is oflaxosin oflaxosin right so this is the spelling right so you can check it here oflaxin right so that is not a right so that is or you can see here I can write again that is of loxin right so this this is o f l o x a c i n right so this is that the of loxin right so these are two medicine right so which is used for the bactericidal right so if i talk about bacteriostatic right so if i talk about the bacteriostatic in bacteriostatic actually these are the some bacteriostatic right so there are some the medicines which is used to just inhibit the growth of microbes right so i can write here that is bacteriostatic right so that is bacteriostatic right so in bacteriostatic you can see here these are the uh, one of the example is erythromycin right so that is you can write here that is erythromycin right so erythromycin right this is the example of bacteriostatic right or you can say this example that is chloramphenol this is also bacterios, bacteriostatic, right? C H L O R O A M P H E N I C O L, right? So this is a, one of example of bacteriostatic, right? Or you can say this another example. Another example is you can say this that is tetracycline, right? So that is tetracycline is also another example, right? So this is tetracycline, right? So now these are the bacteriostatics. These are the bacteriostatics and this is the bactericidal, right? So now let's check for our options, right? So in the question is asked that bactericidal antibiotic, right? So you can see here, these are two bactericidal, penicillin and oflaxosin, right? So these are the two antibiotics, right? So that means in this way, I can say, I can say this option A will be the correct answer, right? Option A will be the correct answer, which is bactericidal antibiotic, right? And rest of these three are 
bacteriostatic right so these are bacterio static right so these are bacterio static right? that means they inhibit the kill growth of microbe right so that can this cannot be our answer right so b c and d will be the wrong answer right so hope this answered your question so thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today